Oh boy, we're here again, Castle Oblivion. Do you remember the featureless white room, the featureless white columns, featureless white floor, the featureless white vases full of featureless white flowers? This Kingdom Hearts are THX. I tell you, it's modern art, and I don't (laughs) get it. (laughs) Riku, where are you? I ask myself that same question every day I wake up. Really, these rooms feel less an aesthetic and more the texture forgot to load. (laughs) Sora, are you okay? Don't worry about me. Riku. Where's that chain go to? What happened? It's like a wallet chain. His memory, it, yeah. Does it go up there to that other chain on his neck? No, that's a different thing. Like no, it just back. attaches to his pants. You know, it's like those but we got rid chains of for your glasses so you don't forget them, except it's your pants. <laughs> right, he doesn't want to ever forget his pants when he goes on an adventure. If he's with Riku, he might be a dinker. Gosh, fellas, we encountered another thing that resembles a thing we encountered at the past here in the memory fortress. What's the deal? I know. <laughs> what was that? Riku isn't your friend. And well, Riku's but never been your friend. Me. He's always been a gigantic sure? douche. Remember when he beat well, you like five times on the island? <laughs> just for the fun of it? But you gotta remember, remember when he hit on your mom? We are in Castle <laughs> Oblivion. Why folks lose their memory? Here Remember when he called your boat time. name stupid and made you redo it? Rick was probably just forgotten that the two of you were. Is Jiminy just friend. training Sora That's to be a battered so wife? So he just forgot? My guess is that so. But Sora, instead of being sad, we have. I know he said some mean things to you, Sora, but it's because he loves you. If we all work together, why we're sure to get you through. And it's also because of his wicked heroin addiction. But don't worry about that. (laughs) (laughs) He doesn't know how to express himself. Yeah. Okay. Good, we did it. He's only mouth impressed now. <laughs> we did it. Huh? Always, Always smile. smile. Don't promise, get depression, bitch. <laughs> That's illegal. You get arrested in Disneyland for that. A callback. It's almost like they planned writing or right. something. Oh, he doesn't do his really shitty <laughs> smile from the first game, though. Oh, who cares then? This LP is over. I don't want to do that again. <laughs> or just mildly happy Sora. Nah, just... nah, no, no, <laughs> I mean, don't get too, too excited. Happy. <laughs> be happy, but not too happy. We still need you to be depressed in order to control you. <gasps> wow! Speaking of happiness, uh, let's go to the Hundred Acre Woods. Remember books? Oh, cool. I love that bear. Ah, be sad. Get out of here, Sora. Oh, I'm allergic. I'm just thinking about Riku and what a jerk he's been. To. <laughs> I have no friend. <laughs> Just trying to recall which of these bugs is a house full of tasty syrup. <laughs> Maybe it is the human being that is full of it, Loon. Oh no! Every fucking time I go here, I have to search for Winnie the Pooh's shitty friends every goddamn time. It sucks that he lost all his short-term and long-term and middle-term memory. Buy a cell phone, Winnie. (laughs) I'm so confused. We're looking for friends. Yeah, you know, like, just like every LP are out there. (laughs) We're looking for our friends. It's been four years and I still haven't found any. Oh, hey, it's that one. 
Mission accomplished. We found a friend. Okay, good job. Let's get out of here. <laughs> What's wrong with it, though? <laughs> I think Piglet malfunctioned. Our friend's broken. Alright, so this is a sneaking mission. Uh, Piglet tries to run away from you in these bushes all the time, and sometimes he pops out. Oh, okay. You did it. Now he just knows him. Now he remembers that he has friends. He, is, he just doesn't have spatial awareness. He's like a three-year-old child. Right. Oh wow, you're collecting a whole party of friends. That's right. Because that's what's most important in life, chirps. Anyway, let's just leave him there. Oh no! It's called weed. <laughs> <laughs> what? I found questions. <laughs> we have found the killer MC emotion. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So, okay, uh, my friend Winnie the Pooh, he wants friends, but he doesn't eat materials. Let's just destroy his house. Oh, hey, <laughs> the Moogle P is in Winnie the Pooh font. That's a nice detail. Yeah, it's it's a very weird, tiny detail that only really happens in this world, where the font is actually different. Yeah. I don't precisely know why. I guess, like... Somebody must have had an extra day and just really loved Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> well, they have all the assets for Winnie the Pooh. They don't have it for the other ones. I guess so. <laughs> so Winnie the Pooh is a lot different than all the other worlds in uh, A Rechain of Memories. Uh, precisely because A, it is both a minigame world, and B, it is actually not just random ass rooms. What? Uh, yeah, nothing has been square yet. <laughs> yeah, they're all just set pieces. What the fuck? Now, however, most of the set pieces are just like Pookie Parts <laughs> 1, but, you know. Oh my god, Pooh's dead. <laughs> Some friend. <laughs> what the hell? What do you mean that was cool? You got hit by a pumpkin. So there are no enemies in this world, right? <laughs> like, it's just the minigames? <laughs> there are no enemies in this world. <laughs> Beyond Sora's cowardice, of course. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Only the enemy within. But so this is kind of like it is in the first game. Yeah. Help me kill Pooh. Would you help me sort my festivals? Unpaid, of course. <laughs> it's an internship. It, it will help out. Right, it'll, it'll look good on his resume. Sorted vegetables for our rabbit man. Sure. Worst part is, he won't even give you a phone number. <laughs> <laughs> this is an undocumented memory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! So yeah, just in general, uh, this minigame here is just fucking bring the pumpkins to the right, bring the cabbages to the left, um, and, and that's kind of it. You can get hit six times, and then you just lose. Can you recognize vegetables? No, I, I've never eaten them, but you know, I can kind of oh, guess Pooh, get out the way, ah! Oh, no, also, sometimes Pooh's survival instinct will just stop. <laughs> he will just... <laughs> Decides, no, that is important to me. I want to get run over. Oh, no. Oh, no! Yeah. Oh, that counts as you getting hit, too? This is that's terrible. That's right. Who and our life force is shared. So, yeah, this is just a really basic minigame, but whatever. It's over in, like, two minutes, so who cares? Yeah. That's yeah. not bad. Yeah. 
and it's got a, a big obstacle, that's for sure. The oh no, happened. carrots! Oh no. Oh my god. Wow! <laughs> right. Ah, great. Oh, it counts yeah. as three. Yeah, that's right. We don't need to do anything anymore but get hit like a stooge. But die. And not even a smart one, like Curly. We need to come aha. back here and extract the ahas and put it in... Close enough! <laughs> put it in some kind of dance beat or something. Anyway, here's one of the best slates in the game. It's a teleporting cloud. Yay. Why does Rabbit know that? What is he doing with it? He is a big anime fan. Oh! Anyway, kind of skipping over to uh, the next part. Uh, this is just the tree again. So oh. here's some balloons. It oh. sounds dangerous. Let's get out of here. Is this the honey collecting thing? Um, yeah, this is the honey collecting thing. So, uh, what, Chops, are you really not noticing how each of these trials we're going through is a cleverly concealed martial arts lesson? <laughs> I, I guess I missed at least from the, the first one with uh, Piglet. I mean... But now that you pointed out, I think I get it. I mean, each minigame corresponds to one of the 36 chambers of the Wu-Tang. <laughs> oh! Sora must prove himself as the true heir to the Hundred Acre Fist of the North Star. <laughs> <laughs> this the way I want to go. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. <laughs> Who's already thinking of death because you're so bad at this minigame, future friend? Yes! <laughs> I I did not notice that on any of my three playthroughs. <laughs> oh bother, time to embrace the void. <laughs> did I always want to die holding on to an anime man? I guess this is it, Sora. Hey, you're skipping a whole bunch. That's right, I I, I don't care. A bunch of this is just kinda of getting to obstacles or getting the high score, and who cares? Like, do you really think a friend is gonna come over to my house and go, Oh man, I bet I can beat your high score in 100 Acre Woods in Chain of Memories. You could never upload these to PSN. That's <laughs> right. It would just... It doesn't even give me a high score, it just says Chain. <laughs> Ascend. Who you were wishing for death. <laughs> I mean, who is a rebel on the edge? He doesn't have any fun unless his nuts are in serious danger. What? I don't remember that from any of the books. That's a common American expression, right? <laughs> What are you doing in my bathroom? That's weird. <laughs> oh, friend, why are you stuck in this book? What a coincidence. The bird thinks we should stay out of the sky and walk. <laughs> Wait a minute. I, I sense an agenda here. <laughs> if I ever find you again, boy, your life will be forfeits. Wow. You rug a burst. This is what that owl will do to you if you ever leave the ground again. <laughs> <laughs> to set you on fire. Oh, it's this thing again. Is it going to be the same thing again? Oh no, don't worry about it. This is. These are the same areas, but it's all new content, baby. Oh, well, thank goodness. Yeah. I wonder what Tigger's going to teach us. He just stares at us. Definitely. Mm. Well, 
This is the same thing you lied to me. No, no, it's it's Simon Says, but it's instead with the lovable Tigger. The bouncing boy, you remember him, right? Yeah. How could I ever forget? Gotta say, this looks pretty tough. Oh, I... Oh, my memory span is two seconds. I already forgot what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's not just incrementing by one each time. So this gets done a little bit faster. Yeah, but that just means it's tougher. Yeah, I think you can handle it. That just means a five-year-old can oh, beat yes. it. We need to get a six-year-old on the case. Just say hello when you finish. <laughs> if you're still thinking about the bouncing, you have not yet achieved the appropriate state of being. <laughs> the bounce must be as nature. Oh, you're so close, future friend. That's right. Are you I'm gonna... sweating like a pig. The last steps are always the toughest. It's almost over. I believe in you, future friend. Please don't. Okay. <laughs> oh, Alright, you... we're out of here. <laughs> oh, you... you beefed it. Yeah. You know, Tigger is quite a one-dimensional character now that I think about it. <laughs> you see, I think if this fiction is truly to become one of the literary greats, there needs to be a reboot which adds some more traits onto Tigger. Why not give him a skateboard? <laughs> or a gun. Why not give him a gun? God damn it! That's, that's right. Fucking make him cool. Maybe he smokes cigarettes. Didn't they make a movie just about Tigger? I thought he already got that, all his uh, character development. That's right, that's the one where he has to get up a smoking addiction. Yeah. <laughs> where we learn that he's the only one because of the war. <laughs> <laughs> he just thinks he's the only one because of the PTSD. Idle romp? What? Oh, you learned how to romp. Thanks, Bambi. <sighs> where, where... We're not going to use, like, n fucking 99% of these. <laughs> oh, well, what kind of LP is this? <laughs> uh, a great one. Uh-huh. Does he have any more friends? Aren't we done now? We exhausted the friend pool. That's my good friend, the blowing well. I wonder what slight we will learn from this well. Oh, it's the same lesson as last time. Holy. Oh, wait. No, it's not. <laughs> like, what? What's what happening? happened? <laughs> this is Sonic Adventure course or something. That's oh. right. We uh, gotta get on a snowboard and we gotta fake, like, I don't know, the Eggman that runs fast. <laughs> What's what's happening? Oh, we they're... gotta get the honey. <laughs> they're collecting you honey. You were born to the... stay out of the sky. This is what happens. <laughs> I just. I like all the noises that Pooh is making. <laughs> oh, that's, that's really good. It seems like halfway between enjoyment and about to hurl. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> you lost him. <laughs> That was pretty good. Bears are one of the only creatures in nature incapable of fear. <laughs> Their closest approximation is a mix of sadness and boredom. 
Oh no, he didn't collect it, or did you? I, I didn't collect it. Happy 2015, though, guys. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm so glad to look forward to 2016. Oh, hey. It's that thing, which had nothing to do with any of that shit we just did. No, it had everything to do with it. Were you in the sky? Okay, I guess it makes sense now. You have corrected me, video game. That's right. You can't criticize this video game ever again, MC. Those <laughs> privileges are revoked. Yes, you're this right. This game is perfect and has no problems. Problem number one. I don't get this rule. Oh, never mind. Well, <laughs> I guess it's a 10 out of 10. about mention that we found him already, so... Well, I mean, can just we gotta go leave to some... We gotta leave some place for interpretation for him. We are searching for Winnie the Pooh's friends, not Rue's friends, idiots. And he had a potion for you. Oh, hey, just oh, sad ass is over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, shake no. it. <laughs> Gross! Okay, okay. I I think we need to call the LT group a bit. So we need to have a meeting, guys. You can do a lot with that tail, you. Let me tell you about some clubs where they give you buckets of cash just for shaking it. We really need to have that meeting soon, guys. <laughs> Fear no bees. Exterminate the bees. So yeah, uh, this minigame has absolutely nothing to do with Eeyore. We have just decided to say fuck it to him. <laughs> Kill the bees. Seems to be our motto now. Yeah, this minigame is pretty much the closest to the actual like, game itself. Mm -hmm. Except you have three card types. You have your keyblades there. Uh, you have a tornado that Sora can just summon. That will get the bees away from you for a bit. Uh huh. And you can reveal who's held there on the upper left with the honey pots. Oh. Huh? <laughs> What's the third kind then? That that is the third kind. <laughs> just, oh. <laughs> just throw a pot on his head. So yeah, uh, this mini game takes a bit, but it's it's not too much of a problem unless uh, you are like me on my practice run in which I forgot how to count. Plus, you get to take it out on the bees. Bees. Nature's heartless. <laughs> it looks like a lot more personality was put into this world than uh, most of the ones we've seen before this. And any of them. I mean, I feel that is always kind of like the thing with both this and Kingdom Hearts 1. Uh, here it's just also because there's a lot more variety in gameplay than you ever get with, like, normal Chain of Memories. Right. This has been a real romp. Because you don't just have, like, a fat bear hanging out with you. <laughs> you I get mean, to throw that honey would be at. Fantastic. Yeah. Why can't Pooby join us on his adventures? Oh my god. But how? Someone was actively trying to hurt Eeyore. But I don't understand. <laughs> I bet it was the demo. I knew Eeyore was in disguise for one second. Yeah, how else would he be able to get up there? It must have been the owl. That owl has been gaslighting this forest <laughs> for over 12 years. <laughs> Thanks for helping me. Well, we didn't. <laughs> you have benefited from our actions by coincidence. No one wants to help me. Oh my god, no! <laughs> oh, I'm so Eeyore. Yeah, okay, you take one Huffington Post quiz <laughs> and you just can't stop saying that. <laughs> <laughs> 
watch. I'm sure with how easily dated our OPs become, Huffington Post will be bankrupt like tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Nice. It's a good card, Eeyore. Thanks for the card. So yeah, Elixir is super handy since, like, it just reloads everything. Oh, that's uh, cool. Too bad you only get a number one at the start, so you kind of gotta get lucky with, like, Moogle Shop cards. Okay. What did the Mega Ether from before do? Uh, I think it just, like, reloads all your magic cards, even the ones that you put in the slate. Oh, okay, that's cool. No, I thought he was getting the present ready. Lucky to have this. <laughs> Paul, never mind. You are an intra uninteresting person. See ya. <laughs> We'll be friends forever, dumb idiot bear. This is the bear that will kill him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, this guy. They say a bear never forgets. Take the hint. I told you to go home. Not until I rescue hey. you and Nominee. Yeah. I don't remember ever asking you to rescue Petri, me. <laughs> Did you forget? <laughs> Kyrie's there, waiting for us both to come home. You're the one who forgot. I told you at Kingdom Hearts when we closed the door. Take care of Kyrie. Also, if I ever see you again, I'm calling cops. <laughs> Give it up. I'm not going back to the islands. For anything. It's not just for Kyrie. What about the rest? You can have those losers. Already forgot them. Nice. That's enough. Damn, that's harsh. <laughs> I wish I could forget about Waka. And they weren't even in the good Final Fantasy games. Oh, who cares? Yeah, they're no, they're no lightning for sure. Oh yeah, I mean she did strike twice after all. <laughs> Don't feel bad. That's what this castle does to you. After a while. He sounds like he's like on drugs when he does that. Like. It's good. After a while, you just get used to it. You forget all the useless stuff. Oh, and remember, he has to be to make this <laughs> game. He's wild. I remember oh, it, Sora. Yeah. Oh no, he's crazy. I now know the one thing that is most important to me: protecting Namine. Nothing else matters. Not a thing. Really, you want to protect the shy girl that everybody forgot about in high school? So in the last game, both of them fought over a different girl. In this one, they're fighting over Namine. That's right. Calling it out King of Hearts 3, there will be two girls they are fighting over. The least interesting over. stand battle ensues. <laughs> I think I'll jog your memory. What? <laughs> I don't what? I'll beat you until you remember me. Can we do this already? Yeah, but what if we did it again? <sighs> Kingdom Hearts, go! I mean, whoever said that you can't repeat a boss fight 300 times, yeah. it's time to fight Riku again. Yeah. Oh, boy, does fight. he have new moves? Uh, he has one new slate. Oh. Also, he is uh, more of a son of a bitch. Oh. He's just, like, more aggressive? Yeah, he is just a ton more aggressive, and he really hits you a ton with his normal attacks that, like, stun you. Okay. Oh, you're gonna show off the cool cloud thing! That's right. Wow. 
Nice. Oh, he really did it. <laughs> I thought he was going to attack more than once, but no, he just... Okay. Yeah, so that slide is only really particularly useful if only because, well, um, it's the second form of Cloud, like if you put two Cloud cards together. Except you only need one this time. Oh, that's cool. And also it just does a shitload of damage. Plus, you don't have to position yourself, which seems nice for bosses like this that jump around a lot. Yeah, the, uh, Riku is just so aggressive in this one. It is actually kind of nuts. Yeah, this seems pretty rough. He's, yeah, he's... Oh, man! Not wow. even Donald can help you. Yeah, like, this is kind of a point where the bosses kind of stop playing by the same rules as you. Because they don't really get as staggered as mm. you do by their attacks. So you just kind of have to switch around really fucking fast and like pull off all the moves. Right. You have to be very but, cool. Oh, oh, I always am. Riku is having a much better time in his cards than he is in this story. <laughs> yeah, he's going nuts in some of those cards. Yeah. Oh, he's dead. Oh, I'm never kidding, Riku. <laughs> Gotta be kidding. My bat wing didn't do shit. What I even order this muscle suit for? <laughs> Too bad, Sora. What? Huh? You can fight me all you want, but I still won't remember a thing. That's yeah. right, I'm an idiot, I, see ya! <laughs> it does seem like a Let's quit really dumb way to solve Let's this problem. Nominate. Together. Right. So like you. So like you to want to do things with friends. You're always trying to worm your <laughs> way into uh, us. <laughs> I'm a libertarian, <laughs> Sora. <laughs> huh. You forgot that too? You never cared. It never mattered to you! You forgot about our prom night, you asshole! <laughs> you won't push me away. You won't push away from this magnet! 